Hello to another vlog from a non-sunny day in Barbados. Uh, it has been raining and it's been cloudy almost every day now. Uh, apart from two, two days or three days, uh, for 14 days it was raining. But today uh, we decided to go anyway. And today we'll try, we'll try to go to Spitestown and Whole Town uh, from our small Christchurch here. And we learned that we should take bus number 27. Let's see how that goes. Let's see it. We came to this bus stop. Uh, its name is Shakira. Uh, apparently you can adopt bus stops here. Just we learned now that uh, if you want to adopt this uh, bus stop, you can call a number and they will put your name here, I think. I don't know how much that is. Um, now we're waiting for bus number 27, but there are other transportations in Barbados, like uh, the small minivans, uh, and they are three and a half US dollars. We took them before, uh, and they have certain routes, but they will drop you off anyway. They are three and a half Barbados. Barbados dollars, dollars, yeah. And now uh, they, all of them are asking us where we are going, if we need a bus or anything, but we're gonna keep waiting for the public bus number 27. Let's see, it's... Uh, I think departed 10 minutes ago from Oystens. It goes from Oystens all the way up to Spitestown and uh, we'll try to take it today to Spitestown. hour and 40 minutes to arrive to Spitestown by bus from Toprak uh, from the Dover Beach uh, and it was a real journey you know uh, like it was very crowded in Bridgetown and then the music was so loud but uh, it was like a panoramic tour so we enjoyed it while we can <laughs> but uh, it was too long so I'm not sure if we're going to do this again but now we're in Spitestown we're going to do it again yeah, yeah, I think so. So I think we're going to head inside town and see the famous Pierre. And from there, we heard a place called Fisherman's Pub a lot on the beach. So we're going to go there and try some rum because we really need it at this moment. So while going to city center, we found a small spot to buy bananas and uh, he's asking the price. I think it's good, so he's buying it. So we'll have some bananas. Is, is, is a banana in it? Because it's too big. Okay. okay. So, uh, no, we have a bag. So we bought bananas. Four twenty-five, right? So two bananas were, I think, um, six hundred grams. So they were huge. We paid four dollars, four Bajan dollars for that, and now we are heading to the PR to eat our banana. <laughs> Spitestown is a 
place designed by an Englishman from Brighton. So of course there's a pier and a beautiful one to watch the sunset. So we're gonna go check it out. There is also a beach there and that's the fisherman's pub. We're going to have um, an early dinner there. I think there is not much to do in Spitestown, uh, apart from seeing the pier and browsing around a little bit. So we're going to walk around the uh, boardwalk and then uh, hit this fisherman's pub behind us to try some rums. It's a short but beautiful boardwalk. So we are walking around a little bit and thinking about our way back home. <laughs> the chicken, of course. There's a small beach here to have a nice swim. I think we're just gonna walk around the town because it's so colorful and cute and the weather is so nice. Just enjoying a quiet afternoon. the door is open to St. Peter's Parish Church and now we're gonna check it out. It's a spontaneous day in Spitestown. We're just lingering around before the sunset.
this is the fisherman's pub where we're we going to sit in a while. I heard a lot about this place. And we're gonna do some rum tasting here for sure. We are walking around in Bristol, in, uh, in Spite Town. There are some small beach bars. There is one called Just Chillin. We came upon a shopping center, a small place where shops are together and there's a supermarket. So we're gonna just walk around. We really don't know what we're doing, but we learned that Spice Town uh, is the second biggest town of Barbados after Bridgetown. It's amazing how big trees can get in tropical places. It's just uh, one tree, but it makes the scene wonderful. So the sun started to low starts going down so it's time to go to fisherman's pub Look my way in you in town I'm wondering your name and I'm guessing that it's real pretty and then some Hey stranger look my way the coffee wasn't great but I'll stay anyway and come back tomorrow and order another one because I like everything about you I like everything about you Yes I do We are now at Fisherman's Pub at Spice Town. We are here to catch the sunset. That's the hell of a sunset here. Uh, everybody knows Fisherman's Pub uh, in the island. It's a, it sells local dishes, as you can see here. But most of the local dish is out of, you know, stock. Uh, we still couldn't try cuckoo and uh, some specialities of the island. But in some time, I think we are going to find and try. So what we're having for dinner is this. We have the uh, vegetable lasagna, uh, fried chicken and fried, banana. fried bananas with beer. Muscle? Yeah. I asked you in Turkish. So we're chilling out here at Fisherman's Pub. The sun has set, we have a beautiful view. And there is live music next door. So next time we are here, maybe we'll try that place. But here, we really like the old wife. We're gonna sit here a while more before we head home. So let the return journey start to our hometown by bus and I see already on the map that uh, there's traffic in Bridgetown because tonight is Friday 
and everyone is, I think, trying to get either at to home or somewhere in the oysters, fish fry maybe. And we'll try to go to Worthing. So we are browsing around a little bit more and uh, we will hit the supermarket and maybe get something to eat late at night and then we'll find our way around. This is what a typical Barba Barbados uh, village neighborhood looks like. It's generally safe here. We never felt in danger. Everyone is so nice. There are no, no dangerous animals around, maybe in the sea, I don't know, but uh, on the streets, no, there are no mosquitoes even. We have made it to the bus stop in uh, Spites Town, just uh, across Shefet, and now we are waiting a bus number 27 or whatever. We just ask if it's Oystens, we get on and uh, we drop off somewhere in uh, closer to our house. Uh, maybe, maybe we'll go to Worthing if you feel like it or maybe we'll just go home. It was a nice day in Spice Town. Uh, we really like the Fisherman's Pub and we like the vibe here. It's, uh, you feel the history uh, here and there are you know, very local places, local bars and it's safe, it's colorful, it's vibrant. Uh, so we came here, we took a walk, we saw the PR and then we uh, had a bite in Fisherman's Pub and then we went to the supermarket, we saw the locals hang out on a Friday night. And now it was a beautiful day and we are heading to uh, home and maybe some more fun. And the bus is coming. Coming. <laughs>